morning to you all students today i am going to teach you multiplication of chapter 5 and this is video number 1 so students i am going to start from i connect section on his birthday ravi is inviting his 10 friends he wants to purchase some items for the party so which are shown in the table given below okay so students see calculate the total number of items here items for each friend total number one birthday cap for each friend so one birthday cap for each friend means how many he uh, birthday cap he has to purchase yes so 10 friends for 10 friends 10 into 1 so 10 into 1 is equals to students yes 10 ones are 10 now here two candies for each friend so how many friends are there yes 10 friends and two candies for each friend so 10 into 2 is equals to very good 20 come to the next three balloons for each friend so 10 friends and each friend is giving three balloons he is purchasing three balloons for each friend so 10 friends are there so 10 into 3 is equals to very good 30 and here one packet of biscuits so 10 friends and he is purchasing one packet of biscuit for each friend so 10 into 1 is equals to 10 so take caps 20 candies 30 balloons and 10 packets of biscuits now students count the people or object in each group and add them come to the next yes see how many people are there and you have to write how many groups are there so first of all count the people in each group so here 1 2 3 so here we will write 3 again just start counting 1 2 3 so here also 3 people again 1 2 3 so here we will also write 3 So students, three plus three plus three is equals to. See, start counting with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So here we will write three plus three plus three is equals to nine people. Okay. So three groups of three players. How many groups are there, students? One group. two groups and three groups so here three groups of three players so in each group how many players are there yes in each group three players are there so here we will write 3 into 3 is equals to 3 into 3 yes 3 three is a 9 so here 3 into 3 is equals to 9 So students, three players in each group means three players in three groups means three times three. So here we have written three times three is equals to nine. Okay, now come to the next. See again, start counting. How many people are there in each group? Yes. See one, two. So right here, two. Again one, two. Yes, one, two. Here also one, two. One, two. So how many people are there? Yes, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Means two plus two, four. Four plus two, six. Six plus two, eight. Eight plus two, ten. So here we will write 
10 see students and how many groups are there yes one group two groups three groups four groups and here five groups see five groups of two friends in each group how many friends are there in each group two friends are there so here we will write five into two five groups are there and in each group there are two friends so five into two five twos are yes very good five twos are ten see students here again so how many times two so five times two one time two times three times four times five times means five times two is equals to ten now come to the last yes see how many objects are there start counting one two three so here we will write three again one two three so write three again one two three now one two three so write three one two three again three one two three so here we also will write three now count how many bottles are there how many objects are there yes one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen so three plus three yes eighteen bottles are there yes so three plus three six six plus three nine nine plus three twelve twelve plus plus three fifteen fifteen plus three 18. So, total number of bottles are 18. Here we will write 18. Now, and how many groups are there? See, one group, two groups, three groups, four groups, five groups, six groups. Six groups and in each group, how many bottles are there? In each group, three bottles are there. So, here we will write 6 into 3. So students, 6 into 3, 6 threes are? Yeah, that's very good. 18. So how many times 3? 6 times 3. 1 time, 2 times, 3 times, 4 times, 5 times, 6 times. 6 times 3. Yes, 6 times 3 bottles are there. So here, 6 times 3 is equals to 18. So students, Multiplication is repeated addition. See, 3 plus 3 plus 3 is equals to 9. Here, 3 into 3 is equals to 9. So students, in the iConnect section, we calculated the total number of items required to celebrate Ravi's birthday. We used the concept of multiplication to find the number of items. So students, in this section, we are going to learn more about multiplication. See, multiplication is repeated addition. It is represented by this sign and this side, you know student, what is the sign? Yes, this is a X sign. Yes, capital X. When we write in English alphabet X, we write like this only. So, it is represented by this sign. Come to the next. The numbers being multiplied are known as the multiplicand. And the number with which we multiply is called the multiplier. The result of multiplication is known as the product. So here student, write the multiplication statement for the following. So how you will write students? Just tell me. Yes. See, how many birds are there? 
in each group yes in each group we have to find how many birds are there so in first group count it 1 2 3 4 so here we will write 4 again yes 1 2 3 4 now 1 2 3 4 so here what we have to do students here we have to add these words 4 plus 4 plus 4 is equals to so just count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 so 4 plus 4 plus 4 is equals to 12 so how many groups are there see one group two groups three groups here we will write 3 times 4 means 3 into 4 so 3 into 4 is equals to yes 3 into 4 is equals to 12 now students this is known as multiplier the number with which we multiply is called the multiplier so this is multiplier The number being multiplied are known as the multiplicand. So this is 4 is multiplicand. The result of multiplication is known as the product. And here this is product. So 3 is multiplier, 4 is multiplicand and the answer is known as product. Okay. Now students, I am going to just show you one activity. Now students, I am going to show you an activity. See, what are these students? Yes, these are bowls. And how many bowls are there? Yes, there are 1, 2, 3, 4 bowls. And in each bowl, I am putting 3 beans. Okay? So, 1, 2, 3. Again, 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. And here also 1, 2, 3. So students, how many beans are there in each bowl? Yes, 3 beans. Yes, 3 beans are there in each bowl. So how we will write students? Just tell me the answer. Because this activity is only for students. They will only give the answer. Yes, very good. So in each bowl, 3 beans are there. So how we will write? Yes, we will write like this. 3. Again, here also 3. Yes, here also 3. And here also 3. So, in each bowl, 3 beans are there. So, what we have to do? We have to add these beans. See, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So students, 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 is equals to how many beans? Yes, 12 beans. So how many bowls are there students? Yes, there are 4 bowls and in each bowl there are 3 beans. So how we will write? 4 times 3. How many times? 1 time, 2 times, 3 times, 4 times. So here we will write 4 into 3. So 4 into 3 is equal to 12. Students, take out your book and do checkpoint 1. See, 
write the addition and multiplication statements for the following so see students how many keys are there yes 1 2 3 4 5 6 so here we will write 6 again 1 2 3 4 5 6 here also we will write 6 now 1 2 3 4 5 6 here also we'll write 6 now 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 here also 6 so 6 plus 6 plus 6 plus 6 is equals to students so start counting 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 20 so 6 plus 6 plus 6 plus 6 is equals to 24 so here how we will write so see how many groups are there yes there are four groups one group two groups three groups four groups so four groups and in each group how many keys are there so in each group 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 six keys are there so 4 into 6 is equals to yes 4 into 6 is equals to 24 now come to the next yes how many pens are there in each group so start counting 1 2 3 4 5 5 so here we will write 5 Again, one, two, three, four, five. Again, we will write here five, and here one, two, three, four, five. So here also we will write five. Now five plus five plus five is equals to. So start counting the pens, students. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So here five plus five plus five is equals to. Fifteen, and now how we will write here? Yes, how many times? Yes, three. How many groups are there? Three groups. One, two, three. So three times five. How many times five? One, two, three. So three times five. Three times five is equals to yes. Three into five is equals to fifteen. So students today i have taught you multiplication as repeated addition now students note down your homework yes now we will start application book b for multiplication so right application book b worksheet 5.1 question number a page number 1 so students this is your homework to do